Prosecutors say a man who beat another man to death with a shovel may have been motivated in part by race. At first, the suspect claimed he thought he was stopping a burglary in West Mobile. Chad Petrie tells us what happened during today's bond hearing. Prosecutors say they know why Morgan Barnhill beat Etienne Murray to death last week. During Barnhill's bond hearing, a prosecutor said they believe Barnhill thought Murray stole something from him and also believe the killing was motivated by race. To the family of the victim, it makes a terrible crime even worse. Just compounds the hurt and the pain I already had. Because you can't help with skin you're born in. And that should not be a factor in anything. We are all human. I am an operating room nurse. I see bodies open all the time. We all look the same inside. Due to his lack of an arrest history, the state said they had no legal reason to deny Barnhill bond, but wanted the highest possible amount. Judge Zach Moore set Barnhill's bond at half a million dollars. If he makes bond, Barnhill will have to wear an ankle monitor and remain on house arrest. Meanwhile, the victim's family says people have reached out to them in their time of need. Showing us love and support. We thank you for everything and your prayers. We definitely do. From losing their son, some good is coming as Etienne's parents say they're donating his organs. Etienne's kidney and he's being operated on tonight so pray that everything goes well and his heart was, is going to somebody in New Orleans that also was recommended by some of my Facebook friends and families. Morgan Barnhill is expected in court again Wednesday for an arraignment. Mobile police say he beat Murray with a shovel and pipe and left his body for hours before calling police. Chad Petrie, WKRG News 5.